Dear brothers and sisters in Christ Jesus, today, the 1st of February, Holy Mother the Church calls us to the memory of St. Henry Morse. St. Henry Morse is from England, Wales, born in 1595 at Brome, Suffolk in England. St. Henry Morse was brought up in Protestant faith, but it was while his studies in London, law studies he was doing, uh, that was at that time he was around 23 aged he became a catholic year two he began uh, to study his priesthood and completed them at rome where he was ordained a priest in 1624 he wanted to become a jesuit so he wanted to join them but by the time they already captive took, took him captive the emperor's people they took him captive and you see the way in which God works. It, it was a Jesuit who was his fellow prisoner. So that senior Jesuit, four years in the captivity, gave him training. And obviously, uh, he, under the guidance, uh, took the simple profession. On his release, he left England, but returned in 1633. This time round, he was very active helping both Catholics and Protestants in the Great Plague. In 1638, he was arrested again and charged with being a priest in contravention of country statutes and of preventing some 560 of His Majesty's Protestant subjects. Six weeks of imprisonment later, he was sentenced to be hanged, drawn and quartered. On 1st February 1645, he was conveyed on a hurdle to Tyburn, where after addressing a huge crowd that also included foreign Catholic diplomats present in silent protest, he received ablution and was executed, beatified in 1929 by Pope Pius XI. Henry Morse was one of the 40 martyrs of England and Wales to have been canonized in 1970. Henry Morse uh, was a Protestant who became a Catholic, who became a Jesuit later, and as a priest, he gave his life for Christ. Life is a journey. It moves from one pole to another pole. And it finally goes and reaches the truth. It happens only when, when I am on the journey of truth. Or else life becomes meaningless, pointless, useless. So let's decide whether to make our life meaningless or meaningful. To make it meaningful, we have to journey on the way of Christ towards Christ. Amen.